Correspondent uh, Maeve McMahon, she did go to Parliament to ask uh, people here about the state of democracy. Just how democratic is the European Commission? One of the questions we're pondering in Brussels today and the one I'm cornering, members of the European Parliament today. I don't see any problem with that. I mean, uh, we have the European Parliament, which is uh, elected through uh, universal uh, elections. Uh, we have the Council, which uh, is composed of the representatives of member states that are elected in their respective member states in a democratic way. And we have the European Commission, which is simply uh, a collection of bureaucrats. I think it's uh, pretty transparent, but I think the European Commission uh, could really improve its transparency. And I think the recent nomination of uh, Martin Sollmeyer really proved it, that uh, the Commission uh, should be aware that we have to deal with citizens and that we need to explain to our voters also the procedures. I know there were a lot of concerns about uh, the way he was appointed and the speed at which it was done. If he was the best man for the job, then I think it might have been better to, which it probably was. It might have been better if there would have been more time taken on it. But I'm not sure any rules reached. But at the same time, it's always better to get people on side so that there would be no questions afterwards. If people are in power, they think also they have the right to do what they would like to do. And also to bring someone in a position, also when it's clear that they will leave this post in the future, um, who could, um, yeah, as, as, a, as a symbol for to say thank you to these people. All right, Darren.